if you stay in bed, if you stay on the couch, if you stay in your comfort zone, if you only do what is easy, your life will be hard. But if you do what is hard, if you get up, if you grind, if you are relentless, if you work as hard as possible when other people are slacking off, your life will be easy. Easy doesn't pay well. Choose the hard path. The path of responsibility, hard work, and sacrifice that ultimately leads to freedom. Too tired, too hungry, too sore, too hot, too cold, too whatever. People ask me what I do when I get those little feelings running around. Well, let me tell you what I don't do. I don't tell everybody. As a matter of fact, I don't even let those words run around inside my own brain housing group. I keep it secure, lock it down. It doesn't matter how I'm doing. It doesn't matter how I slept last night. It doesn't matter how I feel. It doesn't matter when the last time I ate. It doesn't matter because I'm going to go get some. Are you going to work out today? Yes or no? Are you going to win? Yes or no? Make the binary code decision. Yes or no? It's a commitment. It's not a feeling. Commitments don't have nothing to do with your feelings. You do it because you're supposed to. Your mind is your strongest weapon, but you must take control of it. You have to tell your brain where you want to go. When your brain tells you to give in, you push forward. When it tells you to take the day off, you go harder. Don't allow your weak feelings to dictate where you end up in your life. You've got to activate the thinker in you. Don't allow your emotions to control you. We are emotional, but you want to begin to discipline your emotion. If you don't discipline and contain your emotions, they will use you. Prove to yourself today, every day, that you can and will push harder than you wanted to, harder than you felt like pushing, past the point of fatigue and far beyond the point of comfort to that outer edge with every ounce of grit and tenacity to where you cross that line, that threshold through the suffering. Your body and mind will always adjust to more suffering, to more pain. Your mind quits way before your body does. So you have to be willing to go way into that darkness and find more of yourself. Regardless of what's in front of you, you still must grind. I feel that most things I do, but still I grind. I don't want to do half the shit I do, but still I grind. And that one day, you see me on a dark alley, running at one o'clock in the morning, no one thing. I was grinding. Where are the warriors that say, I'm going to make a decision and I'm keeping it. And regardless of how you feel about it, it doesn't matter if the world is crumbling down around you. It doesn't matter what's happening. Just do the thing every single day, whether you feel like it or not. Oh, I don't feel so good today. Get your lazy sick ass up out of bed your only commitment is to the activity not to the grand scheme not to the big picture not to the implications of what it is that you're doing it's to do the thing it's what you fucking do every single day that matters more than anything devote yourself to something bigger be decisive about what you're gonna do and then be disciplined about getting it done every single day whether you feel like it or not 